How's it going ladies and gentlemen, Ninja Mill Tricks here. Today I'll bring to you five reasons why Death Note needs a season two. I was about to, two, but that's one plus one, two. Two, season two. Gay! But before we begin with that, ladies and gentlemen, you might have realized that I said that I was going to be consistent in this video based on a new idea that I had found, but unfortunately it didn't go to plan. But is with this week that I've come up with something fresh, something new, and that is this schedule right here. I've thought about this quite deeply and figured out that this schedule that you can see on the left right there is how I'm going to be structuring my content throughout the next couple of weeks. I've got a solid idea of what I want to get done, and that's basically it. So hopefully this appeals to what you want to see. I wanted to range between anime and games, so that's what I tried getting in, but Obviously for those that are more into games, you're going to be seeing a lot of content for that. So ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, let's begin with the actual video itself. How to use it. The human whose name is written in this notebook shall die. For those that don't know, Death Note is one of my all time favorite anime, all time favorite mainly because of how awesome it was with the two characters rivaling each other in the form of their own justice and it was awesome. But to those that have actually seen this anime, you probably know that it ended quite abruptly in a way that literally shattered my heart. Man, I was just so shocked to the fact that things turned out the way it was because of so many factors. But I won't be spoiling anything in this episode. I don't want to make anything spoilers. Oh, spoilers. <laughs> That made no sense. I don't want to include any spoilers over this video, so I'm going to keep that spoiler free. So without further ado... Listen for the voice of God, then follow it. And know that in time you will find your salvation. First reason to why Death Not Needs a Season 2 is mainly because the initial ending sucked ass. Legit, it just sucked. I didn't, like, vibe with that ending at all because it ended so abruptly in the, like silliest way man with uh freaking light acting the way he did it sucked sucked now we've narrowed down the problem but here's the solution i feel that the ending of the actual anime itself could have went two ways like it made sense yeah for light and l's uh rivalry to have ended the way it did but going with that rivalry having been concluded and then going against the whammy house with um the other character Melo, like it could have ended better in terms of him not facing those guys at the whammy house either that yeah and instead of a season two more like the anime could have ended better it could have ended completely with just um light and l's uh rivalry having concluded where it did it didn't need to like go on this is kind of like opinionated really opinionated let me know what you guys think in the comments below yeah this is completely opinion so if you guys think that um i'm just rambling about what i think or like i have no jurisdiction in changing the actual thing but this is just my opinion or what i think could have been lit like more awesome based on me being an actual huge fan of the series itself so the summary of that point is just basically either light and l concluding their rivalry where it did or simply expanding onto light doing other things rather than facing um the mandem from the whammy house because they just i i i didn't like those guys just taking over l's work and it just seemed suckish man it sucked second point really short light lives l lives Shinigami world done there's so many ways the anime itself could have went even the manga but it ended so abruptly at where it did but i'm gonna just leave it there Shinigami world light lives L lives day 25 of the time of your death day in and day out the same news on permanent repeat and going on from that point, there was a chapter that was released for the actual manga itself where it ended and it was more of an alternative ending to the actual ending and I totally, totally loved that chapter mainly because it gave such high hopes for the, cam the manga continuing and it just like, it led me to think, yo, it's actually possible but at the same time, it seems like such an like hopeful kind of 
thought, man. So it's shambles. But yo, the link is in the description. You can check out the alternative chapter if you'd like. It's awesome. If you've seen the anime or read the manga, read this alternative ending. It's far better than the actual anime ending. It's so much. It gives you hope for a continuation. And yeah, that's one of the biggest reasons why I think Death Note needs a freaking season two. It's just there's hope of its continuation. But the manga creator is abandoning us, bruh. He's, he's just leaving us to freaking ponder at what could be rather than what should be, bruh. I'm so, I'm so mad, bruh. I'm so mad. And fourthly, to be honest, Nia and Melo would just want to be else. Like, I know I might get some smack for this in the comments if you've seen Death Note. But legit, without a doubt, I'm just telling you guys right now, Nia and Melo, as soon as they appeared on the scene, I was just... It, I, I dreaded each episode, to be honest. I, I kept myself watching, just mainly because of L, of Light, sorry. But if those two characters just existing within the anime, it just frustrated me so much that I just... I just didn't want them to be there, man. They just want to be elves. Like, Melo, Melo, like, they always pretty cool watching them do their thing, but they ain't no elf, bruh. They ain't no elf. But that's just my opinion. And five, last but not least, I might have said that I, that one of the reasons were the biggest reasons for Death Note needing a season two, but this takes the cake. This takes the freaking cake, mainly because why? A Death Note movie is coming out. You may have seen from my last video, if you haven't, check it out right here. There's a Death Note movie coming out. And it's gonna be shambles. Legit, it's actually gonna be full on shambles. I'm actually fearful of the outcome of this movie, mainly because they've changed so much about it. They've changed if you've seen the previous Death Note movies, you've seen Japanese cast, Asian cast, lookalikes. Like you think, oh, I could see L like looking like this. But this, they've changed everything. American cast, freaking, no one looks like the character they're playing in the actual anime Death Note. And it's shambles. It's legit shambles. I talk more about it in this video. If you'd like to check that out, just click that video right there. Lit. But ladies and gentlemen, that concludes the five reasons to why Death Note needs a season two. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And of course, leave a like if you did enjoy this video and subscribe for more awesome videos. I got much, much more content coming your way. So definitely stay tuned for that. by subscribing. And of course, I'll see you guys in the next video. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Take care and peace out. Bam! I need to stop that. I actually need to stop that. Stop. Oh, no. Nah.